Good day and welcome to the first episode of Time Capsule. Uh, it's a small series where myself, um, Gorilla, will be playing different um, old and outdated games. Ones that, you know, have kind of fallen off the map now, but, you know, we're, we're uh, pretty good in their day. So, um, the first one I got for you guys is called Space Colony. It's kind of a sim game. Uh, you, you know, you care for the needs of your um, characters, whatever you want to call them, NPCs. Um, well, they're not NPCs, are they? Because I'm controlling them. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, and you build stuff, and you harvest things, and generally try to maintain a balance of, you know, then you have objectives. But, uh, yeah, this game, Space Colony, um, created by... Um, Firefly. There you go. It's right there in the bottom right. Um, with Firefly Studios. Um, it was published by The Gathering, which I believe is something uh, as a group associated with Take Two Interactive. Um, but yeah, without stop all the talking and let's uh, get into it. <coughs> so, what I think we'll do is hop on into the campaign. Play Here's Space campaign. Colony. Play sp oh, what? Is this what I wanted to do? Oh, right, yeah, I played a little bit just to re, uh, re familiarize myself with it. Uh, but we'll start from the beginning. Planner team, this is Control. How you guys doing down there? Just fine. Walk in the park. Making our approach. Give me a minute. Sure thing, Venus. This one's better than the last stop. No bar, nothing to do. So boring. The company picks some stick, not me. Yeah, yeah. Wasn't so bad. They had a jacuzzi. Okay, heads up. We're going in. Down and clear control. Give me the floods, please. Computer. Computer. Oxygen level stable. Pressure stable. Interior temperature at two degrees and rising. Damn, it's cold. Quit whining, Stig. But I like whining. <laughs> Knock it off. Get on the console. Nitrate levels look good. Should be plenty of nutrients. Don't tell me we get to eat this time. If you're lucky. What have you got? Yeah, faint life signs. A couple of big ones, but nothing close. Run it through the database. Uh, no can do. Too much interference. Probably the storm. Will whatever it is cause us any problems? Nothing Stig can't handle. Fine. We've got a ton of iron deposits. Still working on the trace elements, but I think iron's where the money is on this one. I trust you've seen the menu. of shredders and an iron rig to get us started. For a steak, a steak, medium rare. Yeah, right. Who's down next, Control? Tammy, she'll be with you in five. Oh, Son of man. A... Oh, that's the prop, it's gone right there. I mean, uh, what's the hell she to do anyway when she gets down here? I'll run her through the training program. Yeah, for a hundred time, it won't do no good. As long as she's out of fire, I don't care. Ah, oh, we better get it loaded. It looks like she's early. You're kidding. Hiya, darling. Hey, Tammy. Great to see you. I've just loaded the training program for you. Oh, right. Well, I was kind of hoping... Computer, fire it up. Blackwater Industries. Power and oxygen levels are to be raised to operational levels. Operative Tammy is to reacquaint herself with these controls. Nutrient stocks are to be established in readiness for base expansion. 
Okay, so this is the first mission. You know, pretty standard. Make some beds, get some nutrients, which is food, and put a certain person on a certain job. Uh, every time you get a new worker, uh, they'll show up here before Hi, the mission. I'm Venus. This is my fourth tour of duty, and if this one goes okay, I'm going home. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, so it's pretty colorful characters in this game. Um, this guy's probably my favorite. This is stick, yeah. Hey, get me one of those new virtuality chairs down here. They sound real cool. And uh, for inside joke purposes, I'm going to be calling him Captain Carl <laughs> for the rest of this series. <laughs> this is Tammy. I do like a drink. Kind of blue since boyfriend 25 dumped me. 25 in two years. Not a prince amongst them. Uh, wouldn't be proud of that. <laughs> She's a bit of a wild one. But yeah, let's get this mission started. Personal shuttle arriving. Here we go. It being an outdated game, the graphics aren't that great, but you know, that's not really what makes a game, is it? It's it's all about the a mechanics. New operative has arrived. Operative Venus. That's Venus. She's like a main character in the storyline. A new operative has arrived. Operative Stig. If you look at her skills, she's got she's pretty good at everything. Zerus. A new operative. Friends with Stig, not too friendly operative with Tammy. Alright, uh, so one of the objectives, grab Aye Temmie, oh, no. unselect Venus, grab Temmie, stick her on the power desk, because that is a job, and then we need to collect nutrients and make some beds. Stig is the nutrient guy, because he, no he's not, no he's not, I lied. Venus, unselect Carl and pick Venus, she is the nutrient collector. There's all these different types of jobs that they can perform. Of course, you need the necessary constructions first. Uh, so, what we need first is a nutrient extractor. And we build that next to these hydromorphous plants. Been completed. Power and efficiency. With that, we can take. No? Yeah, I got you selected. No problem. We'll sign that as her job. That's her number one job. They can also have secondary jobs, which, you know, if that job needs to be done and their first job isn't, you know, it doesn't need to be done, you know, like say this, you know, you've got full nutrients, she'll stop doing that and go do her second job. Um, okay, so Stig at the moment's not doing much. Uh, we'll put him on oxygen You're the boss. Now. Then we've got med bay as well, but we, uh... Don't have anyone that can do that yet. Alright, so she'll start collecting the nutrients. And to be honest, I'm going to build a airlock. airlock. Because at the moment we have one airlock, which is here. So they have to keep buggering off around the side here. So if we stick one there, that'll kind of make it easier to get in. If I don't talk to someone soon, I'm gonna go stir crazy. Yeah, that's cool, yeah. Tammy. No one cares, though. Okay, um, I believe, I'm just going to check something real quick, not hints, not that, is it escape, options, uh, help, key, key concepts, needs and desires, buildings, blah blah blah, uh, is that what I'm looking for? I'm looking for the rotate, because I'm not sure you can rotate buildings. I'm, I'm not sure. I don't know if there's a hotkey for it, or if you're just stuck with, you know, the way it puts it. EQ. I'll try, like, default ones. Greater than, less than. User joined your channel. Um. Hello? Over here! Can somebody please talk to me? Shoot. Uh, sorry about that. Forgot that I was in TeamSpeak, and uh, yeah. Anyway, moving on. Um, let's see. Right. So yeah, I was trying to rotate these stupid beds, but screw it. We'll just be like that. Now uh, I need to assign the beds. So you pick your person, You're the boss. and you assign the bed. 
quick way to just pick people is just go down the bottom corner here, pick your person, mm -hmm. your Venus, oh, and then oh, Tammy. Okay, okay, okay. That's sorted. So now we're just waiting completed. for nutrients. So we'll just speed it up. There we go. First mission is a success. It's not like it was very hard though, was it? But yeah, credits, space evaluations, that's like your score, credits carry over, so you, you know, the better you do in one mission, the more advantage you have in the next, so it's always best to try and, you know, do your best. But uh, yeah, we'll go on to the next one. Blackwater Industries. Final preparations before mission instructions arrive. Base cleanliness levels are low and are affecting staff morale. Use the cleaning stations provided to rectify this situation. Hygiene pods and social area facilities are now online and available for staff usage. Cool. Sig and Tammy are already at each other's throats. Better sort them out soon or things are going to get out of hand down here. Well, anyway, we got some showers now. Let's get me, them, and this base cleaned up. That's uh, a bit of flirtation there. I don't know. Let's get a bit of a vibe. Anyway, friends. Okay, so this mission is to make them friends and clean up lists. Cool. No new people, but that's fine. Um, right, so to do that, we need that just a not happens. Cleaning, cleaning post. post. Jab that Power in efficiency, there. 30%. Where's Tammy. Your second job is Whatever to floats your boat. Or actually your first job. Personal message. You're not very good at the power, Okay, right? let me give you some good advice here. Mm -hmm. Stig and Tammy need to sort out their problems before yep. things get out of hand. Yep. Get us a social area down here, and then just tell Tammy to go and talk things through with Stig. Yeah. Yeah, that's one bad thing. You can't rotate. Um, but that's bad, because it gives you all the rotations here. Yeah. Um... Green. Let's do this one. Now I'm going to put the mess hall, which is where I'm going to be eating, somewhere around there. So I'll put this as far as I can over. I think that should be enough space. Um, dig. What are you doing, buddy? You can forget it. Don't want to do it. Don't want to do it. <laughs> he needs to his balls, he is. Um, mess yes. hall. Yeah, bits. There you go, Stig. Get you some food, mate. I mean, Carl. Get you some food. Yeah, okay. But, of course, we need to... I'm not sure if making them talk while he's hungry is a good idea. Stig, mate. Go get you some food. Nutrients are there. Doesn't anybody want to talk to Tammy? Doesn't anybody want to talk to Tammy? No, Tammy, you're freaking weird. <laughs> Is he getting you some food? Yeah, that's his. So there's a star by his. Um, by that's the need, so that means that's his most important need. It'll affect his work schedule more. Uh, right, so let's click on Stig, view relationships, click on oh, Tammy. Oh, no, not that. <laughs> we'll go make them through talk. Yeah, it's gonna be messy around here. Shouldn't be be in the mine. You said it. Oh, come on now. You ain't lived till you had a wet willy. Let me try it out on you. What? <laughs> Just don't feel so good. Oh, this base needs some more medicine. Are you an idiot? What a terrible Stig place this is. Friends. Maybe. Okay, let us go, Stig. Okay, so they're friends. Cool. Looks like two... Are you work? Oh, like Venus? Personal message. Oh, I think that means... Hey, look out there. Right at the edge of the base, there's some pretty little red lights flashing away. Who put those out there? Her, her, her. Personal message. I'm trying to. They're mm. operational zone markers, Tammy. A scout ship drops them down here. We're not allowed past them. Haven't I told you this already? So now we're just waiting to clean up stuff. Uh, so let's speed it up. What 
Personal message. Hey, Stig, did you hear that? It sounded like a marker beacon dropped to me. I guess we're gonna start to see some real action soon. Personal message. Yeah, I heard it somewhere to the north. Mission success. Mission success. Oh, they're best of buddies now. There you go. Go on to the next. Blackwater Industries. Blackwater Iron Industries. deposits have been detected to the north of you. Investigate the newly opened zone and locate the marker beacon to find the iron. Scans also report quantities of rapidly spreading vegetation in this area, along with associated primitive alien activity. This must be cleared away before extraction of the iron can begin. Your employment records show that at least one of you is a moron. <laughs> but anyway, that at least you all should know me by now, so no need for any pleasantries. <laughs> the planet you are on and its related systems are of special interest to the company. Your team is, as of now, bookmarked at number eight on my favorites list. Congratulations. Catastrophe. Waterhouse himself is going to be watching us on this one. Instead of my end-of-the-year retirement plan, I now have an end-of-the-year death plan. Brought about by A. Exhaustion, or B. Aliens eating my brain, or C. Mining some new experimental rock that Waterhouse is enthusiastic about. We are finally settled in, however, and it's good to get our first real orders. Okay, so stuff gets a bit more interesting, and we've got a new Name's person. D. I like regular meals, I like a tidy base, I like my own personal space. You listen to what I'm saying, and we'll get along just fine. Cool, man. It's wrong. Colony activated. Opening for good zone. So for sure. Vegetation encroachment detected. This guy will be the, uh... Oh, medical. You smell like a dead lion. Forty percent. A new operative has arrived. Operative. Okay. Dean. No, let's go check out the hood. Dean. The base has no medical facilities. Personal medicine. The base has no medical facilities. Hi, I'm Venus. Okay. It's nice to see a new face down here. I hear you've got medical skills. You don't know how happy that makes me. Personal message. Hey, I hear you made the college basketball team. I don't know about you, but I could sure use a workout. Control has put a gem online. That's got to be credits Small well spent. Dog. Sweet. So we get Small a bit more options dog. this time. Um, but yeah, from here the game just gets better and better and better. Uh, you know, you get new, you unlock new things, and uh, the objectives become harder. There's different ways to play it. Of course, there's sandbox mode. Some, you know, free player. You can make your own missions. You create your own worlds, etc. You know, it's a pretty good sim. But, uh, yeah, I think I'll leave it there for the first episode. If you guys want to see me do an actual series on it, let me know. I'll continue from this one. Um, and, uh, yeah, I don't know how often I'll do time capsules, but whenever, you know, I'm, pop, an old game pops into my head or I find it, run into it, or whatever, I'll do, you know, a quick episode. I think it's pretty good to, uh, you know, go back to the roots of gaming and see what, you know, remember our predecessors. Yeah. But anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!